wanted to give a little tip on putting a saya on a knife. Sayas are uh, difficult, to say the least. The reason why is, uh, you know, they're a pretty simple concept. They, uh, they usually look something like this. Uh, the problem is that most knife manufacturers don't make sayas for their knives. So, and they're popular. So we try to fit different sayas for different knives. Uh, the problem is all knives aren't the same shape, uh, the same thickness, the same blade height, length, etc. So we're often in the position of trying to um, fit something that doesn't quite fit and oftentimes the saya can be uh, too loose which is a better uh, outcome if it jiggles around a little bit it's not that big of a deal you can actually uh, drill uh, the pinhole so that it's tight against the choil here and um, that's that's probably an easy fix um, it's just drilling one hole the other uh, thing that can happen is this is a 240 saya and this is a 240 knife and you can see that that's about as far as it will go and uh, it still has a ways to travel up before it will reach the pin so in this case um, what we'll do oftentimes is we'll just take a drill and uh, we'll select a bit that is pretty close to the size of the slot and we'll drill this out and by expanding this just a little bit down oftentimes we can get it to slide in so pretty easy That was about 30 seconds. And you can see that, that that made it uh go in better, but not com not completely. Give it one more shot. By the way, you gotta be careful, right? I mean, if you're if you're doing it like this with in your hand and you come out of the the slot you can gr you can hit your your hand under here so it's probably a little smarter to if you're not using a clamp or something to hold it like this I'm pretty confident with a drill though so. That worked pretty well. So that's a that's a way if you have a saya that's just a little bit too tight to uh, to drill it out a little bit to adjust.